Hi, I'm Mary Ellen, and today I'm going to follow up with the personal safety, and then I want to announce the winners of the two BK Beauty brush sets. I am not sure what happened to this video, but I had to delete 20 minutes out of the middle of it, so I will cover that at a later date. I wasn't going to put this video up, but I knew I wanted to announce the winners of the BK Beauty brush sets, and I felt that some of this information may be helpful, and hopefully I'll be able to figure it out before I film another video. When I have to do voiceovers, I put a photo in that kind of makes me smile, and this was uh, four plus years ago when I had short hair and found out that my silk pillowcases did not help when my hair was short. And then I found out that they had silk nightcaps that worked so anyway so it always makes me laugh when i see this photo and i want to tell you what prompted my personal safety thing i've always been into personal safety especially with the older patients i had in my nursing career not too long ago jim said if i ever fall and can't get up don't call your family just call the ambulance and, and i said jim you have no idea how much an ambulance costs where we live in the state of Illinois, a regular ambulance is not chargeable to your insurance, nor will Medicare pay for it. So after a little bit of uh, searching, I found someone to talk to who provided ambulance for our area, and that service is from like an hour from here. So I found a very, very nice lady, and I said, all I need to know is I live two tenths of a mile from a hospital. If I needed an ambulance to respond, and the only thing I needed them to do was pick someone out of the floor and take them to the hospital for assessment and, and, and don't do anything else, how much would it be? And she said, just to get the ambulance to your place, it would be about $400, between $380 and $400. That is the minimum amount, and you're responsible 100% for that. So that's what a lot of this started. He did not want me to disturb my family that lives two blocks from here if something ever happened, but I think maybe I've got him to change his ways. I don't know. I read, of course, I always read all of your recommendations, and I did quite a bit of research on trying to find a safety device that someone could wear that if they fell and didn't have the ability to call for help, that it would go ahead and do it for you and I found one safety device and it was $60 a month so in 12 months that's $720 that's not horrible I mean depending on just like everything else what you're willing to pay I did find out that Android has a watch and I think it is a Galaxy 3 by Samsung that it has the ability to do fall detection but I don't I can't find out if it has the ability to make calls for help. So that's something you might want to look into if that's if you have Android. I did pay a lot for my watch just because I needed the stainless steel. But if I were to purchase it again, like I'm hoping to with Jim, I found one that is around $350 that will do everything that I would need a watch to do. The important thing for the safety is it that it is cellular, so you can add it to your cell service and that it has GPS, GPS and cellular, if you want the most out of what a watch can do. And, and like I shared last time, it's $10 a month to add the watch onto our cellular plan. There is no solution that is perfect, but my mind got to going about this. If you have someone that you are a caregiver for, or you have caregivers for that person, as long as your loved one has the watch on, should they escape, should at the home, I would escape your home, that's what they call it, but should they wander off, there's apps that you just have on your phone that you can find that person, which I think is amazing. It's not uncommon for someone to wander away from their home, somebody with memory issues, and I just think it would be just wonderful to have. I just, I'm thinking, what I do is I think of situations I've known of in the past, potential situations that can come in the future, and I just like to share those with you. I do want to share a comment that I received from a viewer. Her name is Stormit54. She said, I take care of an elderly man that wears a Guardian Medic Alert pendant that has fall detection. 
It is connected to AT&T Cellular. If he falls or pushes a button, a human will speak to him, whether he responds or not. We have it set up for them to call me rather than 911, and I'll make that decision. I will be called even if he says he's okay. But it has fall detection and has to be charged every two or three days. We paid for a year in advance, and I don't recall what the cost of the service was, maybe $500, but that could have included the cost of the pendant. I'm going to put a, I could not put a direct link. For some reason, it wouldn't make a direct link, but I will put a link into the company and also the name of the device that she is speaking about. And I want to thank you so much for this information. Now I would like to announce the winners of the BK Beauty brush. And these sets were given to me by Lisa J from BK Beauty. And this is a photo of the 101 brush that I demonstrated on my last video. I purchased this several months ago and anybody who's watched me for very long knows that I never put on foundation with anything but my fingers. But there's just something about this brush that made it easy. And the brushes in these brush sets can be purchased separately. This is called the Essential Face Brush Set. And when I went to randomcommentpicker.com, the first person's name that came up was Londa Hale, and she wanted the face brushes. She mentioned those first. So congratulations to you, Londa. The winner of the complete eye brush set and it's, it, she named it for small or hooded eyes, and anybody can use these brushes. They're just a lot easier if your eyes are small or hooded to use brushes that are the appropriate size. The name that came up is Lucy Brown. Congratulations to you, Lucy. Be sure and leave a comment below, and I'll let you know how to get in touch with me so, so I can get the brush set sent off to you. Now on to my noisy closing. I will tell you, this is what my whole video sounded like. This is what the rest of the 20 minutes that I took out, it's exactly how it sounded. And hopefully, I will see you all again in two weeks. But anyway, it is all good. Thank you so much. I appreciate you more than you will ever know. And I will see you in my next video. Take care. I'm, well, anyway, I don't know about that. But be sh Ambulance a regular ambulance and pick 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 someone out of the floor to add the watch onto our cell to add the to add the watch onto our cellular plan well to add the watch